Hey guys, it's Jacob from Edges. We are finally ready to publish our Cyberpunk for all video editors and uh, I'll show you how, how it works uh, on an example of After Effects but remember that these files they will work in any video editing software as long as they have blending mode and some basic uh, video editing features. So uh, basically what we have is a bunch of video files so the alphabet and uh, backgrounds the pre-made videos uh, mp4 format and uh, pre-made stories so they are video files and you can import in your video editor it will work in Sony Vegas, DaVinci, uh, Final Cut, Premiere Pro uh, After Effects, PowerDirector, any any software, video editing software, you know. So this is uh, I have been playing with it uh, for a few minutes. Just uh, let me remove it or hide it. So what you have is a basic video uh, like this, and uh, what I did I, I drag and dropped uh, a story from the folder and uh, I applied it, uh, imported it to my timeline you can see it here so what I did, I applied a blending mode like this, so you can choose either blending mode add or screen or you can actually leave it like this, if you, if you don't have any videos you can actually leave it like this and uh, this will be a background but uh, in my case I'd like to show you how to use it with the video so I applied add now you see that uh, you already get a great look uh, but you can uh, make it even better in this case my color cor correction matches but uh, you can also apply some curves Like this. Uh, uh, let's say you want to apply another story. Not a problem, you just drag and drop it uh, in the timeline and replace it. So this story it has some um, pre made uh, characters. So this story it's uh, a little yellowish and uh, What, what I did there, uh, I applied the hue saturation effect again every video editing software has some color correction, color correction uh, uh, effects so you see the huge difference right away and you match it to the story color or otherwise you can uh, apply this effect to the story itself and uh, uh, match it to your video well, but you can go further and you can combine those two so you see uh, it also works you can combine different blending modes uh, you can play with it so you get an interesting effect in the end now if you'd like to add a, a text there is no universal solution uh, for every video editing software but uh, what we did we created uh, this uh, pre-made videos with each uh, letter so you can drag and drop them one by one and uh, uh, combine your word on the screen so it's already animated as I showed you in the beginning and uh, you will get your text I know it's not perfect, but uh, this is the only way uh, we can make it make it universal so it uh, works with uh, every video editing software because otherwise it would um, took us ages uh, to prepare a version for every video editing software. So these are the basics 
you can uh, apply any video uh, underneath so again you can just uh, turn everything off and use it by default it, it will also, also look great so each story is 15 seconds so for text uh, I usually put them uh, to appear one by one so if you read from left to right you have this uh, nice effect and uh, in order to make the size lower we made animations only one second long but uh, you can apply time remap uh, in your software and just uh, extend it uh, for as, as many uh, seconds as, as you want uh, because the last frame is still uh, the package size right now is about 10 gigabyte, but we are working to make it lower. Uh, so this will cover all your basic needs in terms of cyberpunk and uh, uh, you will get the result. However, I must warn that uh, uh, the result might be different uh, uh, from what you see on the website because uh, uh, in After Effects uh, you have more flexible um, customization and uh, layering so the result might be a little more flat uh, I will attach a sample file in this in description so you can download it and uh, test for yourself but uh, we are also working on advanced uh, version of this package so we will export uh, the story not in one file but in about four or five files so each layer will be a separate file and then you will have the same customization you have uh, in After Effects and uh, it will look even better but uh, as I said for now it, it will work fine uh, and uh, we will prepare the advanced version I hope uh, next week ok that's uh, it for now and I hope you guys enjoy and um, uh, let me know if you have any questions. Okay, see you. Bye.